What's up, everybody? Gamer here for another episode of Let's Play Pokemon Leaf Green. Uh, we last left off challenging the other person, and uh, I ended the video after I, well, I started fighting her Bulbasaur, and uh, I won actually, obviously. So yeah, whatever, you know, you know. So she's got her Oddish, I'm going to send out Cream Pie, and all Aerial Ace, because Cream Pie is amazing, and can kill you like that. Yeah, sorry I couldn't do what I planned for Easter, um, I had a lot of stuff to do, and stuff kept getting in the way, you know? Well, you don't know, because you weren't there. But, whatever. We're going to go for Firo, and she's going to send out her Gloom, and we'll probably kill it in one or two hits with secret power. I don't know. So let's see. And she's paralyzed. Awesome. Always wanna- Oh, Darn. I just got put to sleep. How dare you put my bird to sleep. Go blink. You can do this. I believe. And she used sweet scent, which isn't pretty useless move, I gotta say. It's pretty darn useless. So we'll go for Dig, because it's uh, the only move we got that's pretty good on it. So, Grim's paralyzed, and we're gonna kill it. One blow. Kapow. One hit, and it's down. Well, after the previous hit from Firo. But, uh, whatever. What I meant to do was face the gym leader, Erica. She has all grass type Pokemon. Pretty easy to beat. Um, like, she's got some good Pokemon. I mean, like, she's got one or two. But she's really not much of a challenge. So, here we go. Let's do this. Hello, lovely weather, isn't it? It's so pleasant. Oh dear, I must do stuff. My name is Erica. I'm the leader of Saldon Gym. I am a student of the art of flower arranging. My Pokemon are solely grass type. Oh, I'm sorry, I had no idea you wished to challenge me. Very well, I shall not lose! We'll see about that, Erica. So she wants to battle us, she'll send out Victory Bell, a really good Pokemon, I'd have to say. I mean, it's not the best, but it is pretty good. So we're gonna Aerial Ace that, hopefully kill it. Oh, it's so close. We got a crit, though. But she's probably going to heal, so yeah. I hate gym leaders. They always heal when you take them down to one little teeny bit. You got one hit left, and they heal. I especially hate it in Pokemon Gold and Silver when you're facing Whitney. And she has her mill tank out. Because that thing is, well, what the name says, it's a tank. It takes like forever to take it down, and then you bring it down to the last little bit. You got it paralyzed and everything. It either uses milk drink, or she uses a uh, um, super potion. Right? Yes. Oh god, I'm gonna die. Uh, let's go to my super potions, my potions. It's gonna use acid again. Hooray! Ah, uh, piece of crap. Let's see how you like an aerial ace to the face. Okay, cream pie's dead. Whatever. We shall kill it with Turbo Lax. Let's do this, Mr. Laxatives. What? Oh, whatever. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Don't kill me, please don't kill me. No! Darn! Uh, killed me. Oh, man. I thought this would go a lot better than it, than it is right now. Let's go for Sparks. Hopefully take him out with my ember. Burn! 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 all. Oh. Now, like, nothing's gonna kill these things. Yes, it missed with Stun Spore. Okay. Hurt by its burn? Kill it! Darn it! Okay, well, we scratched it to death. Victory Bell's down, we got a thousand EXP. Not bad. Entangle of this one sucks, so we should have him out of the way pretty quick. So let's go for an Ember, hopefully take it down at least half health, or take it past half health. It's going to use Ingrain. That move is pretty annoying because it, well, it's not the most annoying because it only heals a little bit of health. 
like a sliver, I guess you could say. And we can still take it out with ease. So Sparks got 853, leveling up to 29. Nice. So she's gonna send out Vile Plume. So, uh, I think I'll go for a Firo because, well, Firo didn't get any action in this gym. So, we'll go for Firo. Let's, uh, Secret Power. Hopefully paralyze it with this. And I guess not. It would use Sleep Powder. Like, that. I think that's Vile Plume. Blech. Vile Plume's only strategy. Put you to sleep and drain you. Then keep repeating the thing over and over and over until you're dead. Okay, about to say, if you use Sleep Powder again, there's no way it could have predicted that. Like, there's just no way that uh, the AI would know that. And, see, I'm telling you, it just puts you to sleep, you have to waste another turn healing up, it's just ridiculous. Um, let's see. <coughs> Sorry. I'll cut that out. Uh, hopefully I can cut that out. But anyway, let's, uh... Oh god, oh god, oh god. Fairy Pouch, please tell me I have... Chesto, there we go. Okay. Only one of them. So, acid. Acid, acid, acid. Uh, let's, uh, peck it up. I guess, yep. Peck should kill it. And Kablooey. Vileplume's down. We are probably gonna level up. There we go. Level 28 Firo. We are just amazing, I'd have to say. Oh, I got the rainbow badge. Yay! I love rainbows! Yay. TM19. Woohoo. Oh, right. Giga Drain. We need Giga Drain. I will be teaching Giga Drain to, uh, der, um, to Cream Pie. Right. Because Cream Pie is the only one that can learn it. So we will replace... What will we replace? We'll replace Sleep Powder. Yeah. Let's replace Sleep Powder because... I'm probably not going to use it as often as Poison Powder, just because, I don't know. But Giga Drain's a good move, heals me up with every time I use it. So let's just head out of the gym and go heal up, I guess. Sorry about the big gap of empty stuff. Uh, let's... yeah, I mean, there's nothing much to say. We're just going to the Pokemon Center. So we'll go talk to Nurse Joy. Here's something I don't understand about Pokemon. How do they tell each other apart, like, all the different Nurse Joys? Because there's like a thousand of them. So how do they know who's who? I mean, they're all related. Ugh, doesn't make any sense at all. Let's go to Pokemon, switch up my Turbolax with my Cream Pie, and switch my Blink with my Sparks, just in case there's a double battle. And we will head over this way again, because there's something we need to get that we will teach to Firo. And you'll probably know what it is when I get to the house. I mean, you probably already know what it is, but here's a double battle. Take this guy on. I think one of them has a Vulpix, or a... Nine tails. I don't remember. Hopefully it's neither, so we don't have to deal with Rapidash and Nine Tails. Well, Cream Pie is dead. Not Cream Pie. Wait a second. I thought I had Cream Pie up front. What am I doing? Water Pulse. Let's go. Um, Shockwave. Or well, Nine Tails. Boom. Thunder. Thunder the Barbarian. And I'm getting a little lag, but oh well. It's Water Pulse, hopefully kill- oh, nope, not even close. Alright, so we'll go for another Water Pulse, I guess. And go for a Dig. Come on, Blink, Dig. That's right, Dig Underground. Dig a hole. Dig, Dig, Diggity Dig. 
I'm just gonna use fire spin. Why fire spin? Like, oh, fire spin does hit you every every turn, so I guess it's not a terrible choice. It's just that I'm not weak to it, so it was, yeah, it was kind of a kind of a bad choice. Blink, use dig. Water pulse. Darn it! One HP. I hate it when that happens. Take him down to one HP. And God, stupid game. Shockwave time. My commentary is suffering, and I don't know why. Huh? I don't know. Well, Turbolax leveled up. That's pretty good. And Blink did not level up yet. Come on, Blink. You gotta level up. Come on. Come on, man. Really? Come on. So, hopefully Water Pulse will kill it, which it probably will. And it does. Nice. So, Rapid Ash is down. Blink is awesome. Yeah. Stuff like that. So, over to the left, I guess. Over here, there's a house that we really need to go in to get a specific move that is rather useful. Notice how she has a Fero in here. See? So, we'll go talk to her. Oh dear, you found my secret retreat. Blah blah blah. I don't care. She's gonna give us HMO2, which is Fly. Fly is one of the most useful... Not the most useful, but one of the most useful HM moves that can be taught to a flying type. Yeah, it is the most useful that could be taught to a flying type. Let's uh, use it on Firo, because Firo has like no good flying stab moves. So I think I think we'll get rid of Fury Attack, just because. And Bing! there we go, fly. But right now I don't think we can do it. I'm not sure. Let's let's go see. Hey, I can. What do you know? Uh, where we're going to fly to is Lavender Town. Because I completely missed something there. You know what I missed? I missed the name raider. He was right in this house down here, and I had no idea. See that? Name raider. I will actually see you next time where you will find out what I named my two poke what I named one of my Pokemon. And my other Pokemon. Yeah, two Pokemon. Ugh, whatever. Uh, I'll see you guys later. Thanks for watching.